can't think about them in here. Okay, we gotta be a man. We gotta observe and look. This door leads to the back alley. There's a photo over there. I'm guessing we're gonna have to get that photo. It's actually a little tough. Like I said, I'm getting a little emotional here. Find anything? It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? What's it to you? To me? I'm not the one with the felony record. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Don't worry about it. She'll remember I trust her. Uh, this is just a facade. I don't trust her. She's like, she's like gonna stab us in the back if we do anything questioning. My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Oh, so sad. Oh, man. It's like I'm, I'm frustrated, Carly. But, I'm, but the situation is so dramatic. <laughs> All right, let's maybe maybe there's some in first aid kit we can use. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Okay, well, we should still take it with us, right? Or I guess not. Um, I guess we gotta move this stuff out of the way. That's Kane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this Kane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. Well, right on. Lee's dad had a pimp cane. He was able to beat people with it, too. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Yeah, we might as well clear it. Better Move get the this desk. door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Ah. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Mm. How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Let's just move this thing. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. It's fine. All right, a little further. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? I wonder if Lee's parents knew about his legal situation. I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things would have been different. 
Yeah. They actually can relate a lot, can't they? I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Ow! Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. Alright, I get it. We gotta use the first aid kit now. Okay. Alright. I got the hint. Alright, now we gotta give that to Clementine. Alright, we're being we're being responsible here. I like this. He's a good man. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Somehow I get the feeling Clementine knows what's going on, but at least trying to keep her spirits high. Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. How's your finger? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. Everyone out there seem alright to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah, we'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. Can you do that more? Well, I'm not gonna go looking for them. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. That was actually really touching. I mean, sorry if I'm kind of ruining the moment, but... Ugh. There is a little hope in the it's dire the situation. To my dad's TV. Right, we got we got the remotes. No idea what that does. That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Mm, that's what we gotta do. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help. Or Larry. find a way to break down the door, but uh okay. Maybe we can do something with this remote. That's what I figured. Nope. That does nothing, let's see. The pants can oh. to survive. It says the same answer. thing. My bad viewers, my bad. I didn't mean to re-click the bed. It's just one of those things where it's like maybe it says something different. Guess not. Alright. I'm not seeing a whole lot else to do in here. I mean yeah, there was a little bit, but I think we're kind of limited. So, are there keys in here somewhere that I'm missing? Not the first aid kit, but I'm feeling the keys are not in there. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. But we should still take it with us, right? <laughs> He's not going to take the first aid kit, is he? That could be Wanna very useful to keep. The drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? She's a really smart girl. Uh, it's complicated. Sometimes things happen or you do things and you can't explain them. Let's, uh, head back to the others. I, I don't really want to tell her straight out that I, I killed him. I mean, I don't really know if he did kill someone or not, but... I, I get the feeling signs are pointing to he did. I mean, granted, it was a situation that was kind of uncontrollable, which you just kind of react because you lose all senses and just go crazy, but... I digress. Gotta see if we can get this radio to work. Maybe the batteries from the remote will work. I found this remote in the office, but I'm pretty sure the batteries won't fit. It needs the big stumpy ones. 
Yeah, these are no good. Well, I, I guess that's a no. <laughs> hey there, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. And you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. I still don't trust Carly. She's, uh... She's keeping an eye on us for a reason. <laughs> but still, you know, it's... It's alright, at least we haven't pissed her off. Still, first chance I get, you better watch yourself, Carly. Okay, well, it's, um... That was pointless, wasn't it? I need to find batteries for her radio. And keys to get into the pharmacy, but, um... Alright, I'll be honest. I know how you get the keys to the pharmacy. Uh, we actually have to go to the end first. Anyways, let's get some batteries. We gotta fix that radio. There's one right there, and give it to Carly. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. And we need a second one, don't we? I'm still looking for batteries for that thing. Thanks. I yeah, he it. said to you. All right. Where could a second battery be? It's probably just laying right in the open, but I'm not seeing it. <laughs> Let's see. We got Lily and her dad. Not going to be use. I'll be honest. I'm just going to cut it. 